Hello, hello. Good evening, guys. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? How are you guys? Today is our Friday. Our Friday. But indeed, it's Wednesday. <laughs> I mean, it's our, our Friday according to the class. Just one moment. We will wait for the rest of the participants, guys, and we will start. Okay, guys, so we will start the class just in a few minutes, okay? Hello, hello, Carla. Hi, Jarixa. Hello, Amilcar. Hello, hello, Jaime. Hi, Jonathan. Hi, Kenny. Hi, Maggie. Hello, Jessica. Hi, Marielos. Hi, Lisette. Hi, Christian. And hello, Julio. Hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening. How are you guys? Fine. Hello. Okay, guys. So let me go through the attendance list, okay? One moment and I will go through the attendance list, guys. Today we will have a practice, guys, about um, the whole week. And for today, remember that we really need to have the homework and all the evaluations, okay? So let's go through the attendance list right now. Today is the day of the cross, right? Happy cross day. Did you put the cross in your, on, in your house? No? No. You know, I don't follow that tradition. That's a tradition, right? Catholic I don't, tradition, I think. Uh -huh, ca ca Catholic ca tradition. Um, I didn't put it in my house because I'm not at home right now. I don't follow that tradition. I'm Catholic, but I'm, I don't follow it. I don't know why. <laughs> but my parents follow the tradition. And my parents put a, a cross on the garden, but uh, it is not decorated. <laughs> I didn't have the time to decorate it, sorry. And there is no fruits and no decoration. I believe the last time I saw it was at 3 p.m. So I haven't seen yet, but it's... It's going to be fourth already, right? It's not going to be valid for tomorrow. But at least they, <laughs> they put a cross there. But I, I don't follow that tradition. Maybe, okay. maybe next year I will do it. Because right now I'm in the middle of something. Uh, so I don't have a... I mean, I don't have my house right now to do it. Because I'm doing a lot of things, so I'm not living there. I'm living with my parents right now, right now. So that's why I was not the one that wanted to, I mean, the should decide that, right? But at least they do it. They try to do it. <laughs> so, in my case, I, I, yeah. I, I don't believe you that, but in the college of my son, uh they they follow that uh tradition and uh, the kids has to have to um bring fruits uh -huh. or put on the on the on the cross uh, in 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 the the classroom right and uh, my son said to me um 
uh, that what is the reason that uh, this tradition mm. and I, I don't have to say because uh, I don't remember in in the past when I when I was uh, a, a, a child mm. uh, I, I I like I did like uh, that tradition but in, in in this time I think all the people forget it I don't know what I don't know either why this is happening, right? Um, I don't know as, I mean, people are like losing the traditions and all of these are, they are not yeah. following the traditions, right? And you know what, that will be difficult. I will study, I will study about this, about the, the day of the cross, if by any chance my, my son, or my daughter asked me, why do we need to follow that tradition, right? Because sometimes we don't know what to what to answer. But I believe that this is in order to honor the, the cross of Jesus Christ, right? I believe that. So that's why we dec decorated with all of this. But mm. this is honor to the cross of Jesus Christ. That's what I remember. My grandmother, my grandmother told me one day that if you don't put the cross in in your house, then at midnight, um, the devil is going to dance in your house. <laughs> uh, if you if you don't put the cross, yeah. <laughs> if you don't put the cross, that's the only thing that I remember. <laughs> my mom said that, but I I think I think she forgot it. Today, but uh, they forgot about all of this, right? Mm -hmm. They yeah. forgot all mm -hmm. of this now. But thank Double you for is, sharing. It's gonna be dancing right now. <laughs> the, uh -huh. <laughs> yes. Oh my god! But I was like around five years whenever she said that. So <laughs> I just imagine the devil dancing. <laughs> I mean, it's not that, that I'm imagining, but I, I'm imagining that it, it was whenever I was a child. I try to imagine that. And then it has scared me a lot. It has scared me a lot to hear that because I was a child. I was just five years old. So that's interesting. Yeah. And I believe that we need to follow the traditions and all of this because we are, we're, we're kind to, to lose all of this, right? But thank yeah, you because very we much. don't have time. We don't uh -huh. have time in, in, in this uh, uh, year, I think. In, in this we are, generation, are working, right? <laughs> we are working all the time. We are, we are so hard working. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We are workaholic. That's the workaholic yeah. generation, right? Yeah. Workaholic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All the time. All the time and then starting all the time. Wow, we are so dedicated. <laughs> Just imagine what time we are here and we're studying and we're learning English. Wow, we're working. Congratulations, Jack, guys. You're doing great. <laughs> but yes, um, and the schools they try to keep that tradition, right? Maybe Jaime and Christian can talk can tell us about the your school guys. Did you celebrate it? No, the school no celebrated. No oh, teacher. Doesn't celebrate it? Really? Okay. All righty. Okay, thank you. So guys, uh, thank you, Jonathan. Thank you a lot for sharing that with me. I'll go ahead and continue share, I mean, continue with the attendance list, guys. Um, I mean, a store with the attendance list. Angela Estefania Marroquín Martinez. Cristian Josué López Pérez. Present. Estela Mabel Orellana del Cid. Present, teacher. Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortés. Present, teacher. 
Jessica El Carmen Vázquez Vázquez. Present. Jonathan Alexi González Torres. Present teacher. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Present teacher. Carla Elizabeth Escobar Esquivel. Present. Uh, then Kenny Lizette Cuellar de Barrientos. Kevin Alexander Aguilar Bonilla. Linda Magali García Montoya. Presentiche. Lizette del Carmen Hernández Smith Smith. Presentiche. Sorry. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Kevin Alexander Aguilar Bonilla. Marcos Amil Carmancía Gutiérrez. Present teacher. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Marielo Janet Cornejo Erazo. Present teacher. Marta Lidia Godínez. Sabrina Lisset García Orellana. Present. Durma Yerixa Oliva Córdoba. Present. José Nelson Ruiz Moreno. Yuri Alexandra Flores Parada. Iliana Carolina Calderón Cisneros. Okay, guys, so let's see. Thank you very much for joining on time. And we will start with the class right now. Let me get just one second and let me open the, the book. So we will start the class. So, um, Whenever we finish the week, guys, we can we have a vocabulary practice, and that's what we will have right now. We will have a vocabulary practice and a review about the topics. So let me share the screen now. Okay, this is the class number five, guys. And as I was mentioning, we have a vocabulary practice. In order to start, we have a writing practice right now. And this writing practice that we will have, we will do it on the page 16. So let me share the screen for the book. And let's go to the page 16, guys. This, um, this is a paragraph. We will write a six line paragraph about the equipment at your company. Use should and shouldn't. We will do it in pairs so we can work together on that, okay? In pairs. I will do the pairs right now. Let me go and just send you the indication about what we'll do. Remember, write a six line paragraph about the equipment equipment at your company. What kind of equipment do you have in your company? The, the things that, I mean, you need to use should and shouldn't. Remember guys, should is for advices. For advices and shouldn't is for things that the person shouldn't do. I mean, for trying to suggest the contrary or to prohibit something, not to do something, okay? Like prohibit something. So this is shouldn't and should for you to uh, give advices. We will make purse for doing this, okay? We will make purse right now. Do you have any questions before I send you to the breakout rooms, guys? Questions? Let's see. Okay, let me assign to you guys to the breakout rooms. Click on join, please. Mm. One moment.
click on join guys. Guys, click on join, please. Click and join. Marcos Amilcar, Carla, Kenny, and Estela. Kenny and Amilcar, click on join. ¿Ya le aparece la opción de join? Amilcar, no. Qué raro. No, me había aparecido, pero me regresó. A ver, deme un segundo. Le va a aparecer ahorita, no le dé clic, sino que claro. le dele clic a la segunda vez. Ahorita, okay. déjeme ver dónde estaba, number one. Ahora sí. Ok. Please, thank you. Eh, Kenny Lisette, are you there? Kenny, 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 Kenny. Hello, hello. Hello, Marcos. 
Welcome, Marcos. Eh, vamos a hacer un párrafo de seis líneas en las indicaciones que mandé acá acerca de los equipos que hay en su compañía utilizando should and shouldn't. ¿Ok? Ok. Thank you. Creo que solamente se va a unir Marta Lidia con usted. ¿Ok? Esperémoslo. Thank you, Marcos. Ok. Eh, sería la primera entonces eh, sí. Sí, para, para tener buena comunicación ¿verdad? entonces estaría bien así should be Como si tendrían que ser viejos, no sé, computadoras nuevas o algo así. Ajá, uh -huh. use, use the new computer. Should I uh -huh. should, should, need, should use the new computer? Teacher, I have a question. When I can use sure on sure, uh -huh. I can use auxiliar. Auxiliar. I no, don't remember. No, because it's, it's a model, so we don't use... Only sure and uh, the verb. Uh-huh, exactly. Okay. And guys, don't, don't forget that at the end you will make one paragraph per, per, per couple, okay? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Thank you, guys. Okay. Entonces, sí, por ejemplo, in the school teacher should use the, the new computer for the online class. Ajá. Eh, skip. <laughs> uh -huh. El anuncio. Ajá. Uh -huh. Skip. The process. Ajá. Uh -huh. Sí. The, the process. Como había dicho la compañera uh -huh. que iba a hacer lo demás. Ahora. Eh, when realizar can, can? Um, in the in the office in the office, equipment of, of lawyers lawyer yeah, for flyer job Ok, vaya. En, la, en el trabajo tenemos equipo. Responsabilidad. No. Bien, podría ser. Ajá. Entonces, eh, should make the decision is Teacher, solo serían como oraciones, eh, haciendo positivas y negativas, o sería un párrafo. Sí, el, un párrafo de, de seis líneas. Por eso lo vamos a hacer en pareja, uno solo, guys. Entre los dos. Ah, ok. Hello, Marcos. Sorry, I don't. 
Ni yo, no es cierto. I don't, I, I don't speak. <laughs> Guys, sorry que entró Marcos de la nada, ¿Sí? pero fíjense ¿Sí? que Marcos tenía uh, una pareja, pero ¿Sí? nunca llegó. <laughs> Entonces, ah. no sé si me podría ayudar para que él esté con ustedes. Un párrafo ¿Sí? por los tres, ¿ok? Ah, un pero, párrafo por los tres. Sí, uno por los tres. Hay que les ayude a Marcos, ¿ok? <risa> Thank you. Sáquenle, sáquenle chispa, please. <risa> ok. Books, books o Marcos. Books. <risa> books. <risa> books o Marcos. Teacher, and now we we can start the the paragraph in my work or in my company i mm -hmm. use a computer yeah. i should turn off the when i finish to work mm -hmm. and i shouldn't i should not turn on turn on the, the ventilator when i when when i leave the classroom mm -hmm. Very good. The the fan, right? The fan, yeah. Okay, great. Good job, guys. Sí. Ahí Marcos le va a aportar la write otra write mitad. Teacher. Marquitos. Sí. How do you write? Mm -hmm. How do you write ventilador en inglés? ¿O qué es lo que? Fan? How do you write that? I don't know. Oh, don't worry. Fam is F. A N fan F A N fan fan exactly F A N F as in Frank A as in Apple and N as in Nancy fan just that thank you you're welcome guys okay um. Okay, now. Okay, um, can I, I talk about my company? Okay. If I use something and then Marcos. Okay. For example, we can write in Mabel's company. Um, has a printer. She should um, she should um, print. Como se diría lo necesario. Eh, the necessary. The necessary work. Necessary. Uh -huh. The necessary. The necessary. Uh -huh. Necessary copies. Sí. Uh -huh. Ajá. <clears throat> Podría decir she, she should print. Uh... No. No. no, no. Eu. Sí. Perdón. <laughs> She, sh <clears throat> she should to print um, the necessary co the mm -hmm. necessary copies. Para seguir, o sea, las cosas que no no se deben hacer. Debería discriminar a los compañeros. Eh, no deberían haber conflictos. Ah, sí. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh.
only the sure use is it use their cell phone. O mejor le ponemos only. Mm -hmm. Um, uh -huh. Como solo si el teacher lo autoriza. Ah, uh, only, only the, uh, only the, only the show. Only, mm -hmm. only the show use the cell phone when the teachers. Uh -huh. Only the. Permítame, quiero ver si usted realiza un documento. No, es que no sé. Eso es más de, más de, de política, vea, de ustedes, vea. Todo eso es de ética y todo. todo eso, <risa> uh, sí, porque al final ustedes hacen lo mismo que cualquiera de nosotros: imprimen, sacan copias. Uh -huh. y, y su trabajo está más relacionado con aquí, pues, documentos. Porque actividades con equipo no realizan mucho. Solo imprimir, firmar, sellar. Eh, ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más hacen? Quiero ver. Ah, firmar, sellar. Ah. Leer. Leer. Leer, ajá. Ah, vaya, podremos poner... De, 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 de que usted tal vez no debería de llevarse el equipo del, o algo de, de, de que tengan ustedes para su casa, no sé. No, hay algo que ustedes tengan que respetar mucho en su trabajo. No. Sí. No, vea, se llevan el trabajo. Sí, no, no, no. Eh, ajá, como las, los libros de protocolo los libros del notario no deben no deberían de salir de la oficina ah vaya ok ok podemos poner eso if sí. you are going to your home if you if you are going to In the Marcos job, has an industrial printer. Hola, teacher. Hello, guys. ¿Cómo vamos? Hello. Ya terminamos el paro. Yeah. De... Really? Wow. Great. Okay. Uh, we will have one more minute so we can wait for the other ones, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay. Thank you, guys. Uh -huh. No, no, sí. Technology for give. Give. Mm -hmm. Forgive. Uh... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Vaya, se lo voy a leer yo ahora. Ok, lea. Okay. Dice, we work in auditing, so we should not skip the process. When we do the reviews, sorry, me quedo okay. We work in auditing, so we should not skip the process when we do the reviews, because we can have many problems. The audit, auditing should be fast and efficient, efficient for ensure the quality of the process and avoid rehab. No, okay. Mm -hmm. okay. 
¿Y por dónde vive, Lisa? O sea, yo me recuerdo que cuando iniciamos habían hasta personas que eran de la Unión, de San Miguel. Yo, es cierto. ¿Usted sí. estuvo conmigo desde, desde cuándo? Conocemos con Miss Beteta. Del 2, mm. lo que empezamos. Ajá. Quiero ver, yo soy de lo urto. Ya aquí por la popa. Mm. Yo ahí casi no conozco. Teacher, me podría unir con mi compañera que se me fue el internet. Hello, sorry, Stephanie, ya regresamos. <risa> Ojalá que él lo haya hecho. <ríe> no, mentira. Es que solo llegamos a la mitad y se me fue el internet. Y hasta ahorita me conecté. Lo dejo solo, Estefanía. No. <ríe> Sin querer, please. Eso me fijé que de repente se fue. Vamos a esperar a los demás. Así como donde, hasta donde lo tengan. Don't worry. Ok, ¿Qué pasó, Fátima? ¿Todo bien? Sí, teacher, tengo sueño. Ah, <ríe> mire, la veía con frío. <ríe> y gran calor, ¿verdad? Sí. Ay, no, Desde en la tarde está un gran calor. Yo creí que solo era yo. Miren, y no, no sé si les pasa, tal vez no, no sé si es el lugar, ¿verdad? pero está donde, donde estoy yo. En la noche hay un gran frío tremendo y en el día gran calor. Pero digo en la noche como en la madrugada. Ahí donde ustedes no es así. Yo siempre hay calor. Aquí está haciendo calor ahorita. Y en la It's madrugada. En la madrugada es algo fresco. Uh -huh. bueno. How do you say madrugada en in, in English, guys? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> um, Wake it up. is oh, no. early, early morning. Early, early, early morning. morning. Uh -huh. Si es como amanecer, ahí sería como downing o down. Oh, you know what? Early morning, yo creería más que es como early morning, como, como a las 6, a las 5, pero madrugada sí es downing, downing. Y amanecer es down. So it's downing, guys. Early morning sí es más como las 5 a las 6 de la... Ajá, como la early morning. Pero si es downing. Me parece más downing que la otra. Early morning. Ok, guys. So, let's see. Um, I want to hear your paragraph. Um, oh, my God. Who wants to, who wants to be the volunteer? Who wants to be a volunteer? How was your writing practice, your writing skills, guys? How was it? ¿Cómo sintieron el writing? Better than speaking? Or better than listening? Oh. <laughs> It's better than speaking. <laughs> It's way. better. Okay. Well, I, I think that when that. We are not used know. to write, right? We're not used to write here. Uh, but this 
this will be one of the activities in which we're starting to practice the paragraphs. So what about if we start with Lisette? Lisette. Oh, I believe it's Lisette, Sabrina, and Marielos, right? All right, guys. Sorry, I'm here. Okay, one of you can read it. One of you can read it. Una de ustedes puede leerlo, don't worry. You decide who. Todas peleándose, mira por la, miren por la Champions. <laughs> Han visto el video de, de la Champions. Sí. Uh -huh. Queremos la Champions. Okay, we won the Champions. <laughs> Uh, we work in auditing, so we should not skip the process when we do the review because we can have many problems. The audi auditing should be fast and efficient for ensure the quality of the process and avoid rehab. Good Finish. job. Good job, guys. I mean, good job, girls. Very good, very good. Okay, Sabrina, could you please choose another person, the next person, besides Jaime? <laughs> oh, <laughs> let me even drink water. <laughs> Estela <Yay>. is with Jaime. <laughs> with Jaime. <laughs> Yes, we I can do it. I didn't know. I had no idea. <laughs> okay. I, I read. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Jaime. Okay. Uh, we were writing a paragraph in Marcos, Mabel, and me. <laughs> it's an ensalada. <laughs> Okay. okay. In my work, <laughs> I use a computer. I should turn off when I finish to work. I shouldn't turn on the the fan when I leave the class. In Mabel's company has a printer. <clears throat> she should print the necessary copies. In the Marcos uh, work, there is industrial printer. He should print a banner with high definition, but he should not cut the, pa the paper. Great, good job. Marco, choose the next person. Choose the next person. Mr. Jonathan. Okay, Jonathan. Oh, thank you. Um, let's see. Um, uh, in, we are in, in, in our case, um, we are talking about the office. Um, about lawyers. I am having the office equipment of lawyers and we work every day with documents for God to meet with the hood. For example, if I have to make a document, you should use a stamp, it's a, it's a request. If you have to print a document, the printer, it should be okay. And um, if you have to work on a notary book, you shouldn't eat some snacks or drink because the, the documents are so very important. And if you are going to home at 
And if, and if you are going to at home, you should not bring notary books outside. That's all. Wow, very good. Good job, very specified. Great. Um, Ajarixa, could you please choose the next person? Carla Elizabeth. Carla? Okay, Carla. Okay. Eh, my work company has the flowing equipment printers, some equipment projectors, um, the printers shall not be used more eight, any eighteen or they. The projector should be used in the old class classroom. The sound equipment uh, should not be used for uh, not a uh, high school activities. Very good. You were with Julio, right? Sí. Great job. Okay, great. Now, uh, Julio, could you please choose another person? Uh, Fatima Denise. Yo. Yes, Fatima and... Christian. Christian. Let's do it, guys. You decide who wants to read. Usted, usted no dicen, guys. Who wants to read it? No sé si empiezo yo, Christian. It's only one person how to read the paragraph. Mm -hmm. I mean, Okay. Okay, I write a paragraph about the school. In the school, teachers should use the new computer for the online class, but they shouldn't have a slow internet. They sh the teacher shouldn't help with a virtual books. The student shouldn't have their cell phone on. Only they should use their cell phone when the teachers authorize. The school should get a new technology for provide better learning for the student. Wow, very good, guys. Okay, Fatima, could you please choose another person or another pair? Mm. Sulma. Oh, Jadik's already best. Who's missing? Who's missing? Um, Stefania, right? Uh, Amilcar. Uh huh. Angel, Stefania, and Amilcar are the only ones that are missing, right? Yes. Okay, go go with Angela, Stefania, and Amilka. What what you have, guys? I know you stopped doing it because of uh, Stefania's internet, but read what you have, okay? In our company, should be good communication. Uh, should take decision and inspire respect. Uh, 
and she attend a trip in a Thailand, and she not uh, share confidential information. Okay, great. Thank you. Okay, guys, so you did an amazing job with should and shouldn't, I mean, should and shouldn't. Um, let's continue then with the practice, with the vocabulary practice that we have. Um, now do me a favor and go to the page 17, guys. Let's see what time is it. Page 17 on the book. Okay, here we have the page 17. We have a conversation here. Uh, guys, what we are going to do right now is to practice the conversation, practice this conversation, and then answer those definitions, okay? Those definitions based on the um, some words that you have here. We have cost, we have inventory, turnover, we have a stock, quantity, and inventory. So let's go ahead and just uh, try to read this conversation. Okay, for this conversation, I would like to have two volunteers. Who wants to read the conversation, guys? Two volunteers. Me, teacher. Okay, Fatima, great. And Fatima, and who wants to read? Me, it? me Good, teacher. Jadix and Fatima. Go for it, guys. Okay, let's do it. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What, what was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? Chocolate, what about the cost? Right, now it's three for this year and the cost is... That's great. That's great. <laughs> good job, guys. That's great. Um, very good pronunciation. Good. Uh, let's see. Who wants to read it? I would like to have another two volunteers. Two more volunteers. Thank you, Fatima. Thank you, Erika. You did an amazing job, by the way. Mm -hmm. I can't wait. Okay, Sabrina and well, me, me, Jonathan. Okay, let's do it. Sabrina, you start. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of cho chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? What about the cost? Right now, it is three for this year. And the cost is 13, 30, $30 per unit. Oh, that's a great. That's a great, sorry. Very good. Good job. Thank you, uh, thank you, Stefania. Sorry, thank you, Sabrina, and thank you, uh, Jonathan. Who wants to read it next? Guys? Who else wants to practice? Okay, me, teacher. Jaime, very good. Who else? Jaime and? Me, teacher. Let's do it. Good, good. Okay, we were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stop our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? 
What about the cost? Right now, it is three for this year, and the cost is 30 per unit. That's great. Wonderful, guys. Thank you, Stefania. Thank you, Jaime. Um, you're improving a lot your pronunciation, guys. I'm proud of you. Okay, who else wants to practice? Who else wants to practice, guys? Who else wants to practice this conversation? I, I see like Marcos wants to practice, but he's like, hmm. Mm, Marcos Antonio Melgar, right? Who else wants to practice, guys? Another two volunteers, the last two volunteers. Sorry. Lisette. Lisette dijo, sí. yo? Yes. Lisette and who else? Marcos. Marcos. Oh, yes, Marcos. I like your attitude. Yes, let's do it, guys. You can start, Lisa. Pensé que me decías, pero me quedé, me puse nerviosa, Titch. Vaya, We were very busy just then. We have a lot, a lot of customers. We need, I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we, yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caram. caram. What was our inventory turn, turnover for chocolate caramel? What about the cost? Right now it's three for this year. And the cost is 30 for per unit, sorry. That's great. That's awesome. <laughs> okay, guys, just repeat after me, BC, BC. BC. And $30, $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $30. $
basada en la conversación, ¿sí? Later on, I will ask you if you understood, if you have an idea, si tuvieran al menos una idea basada en el contexto, porque guys, in English, you won't know the whole meaning of the words, but sometimes you understand it or you understand the words by context, okay? La mayoría de veces ustedes van a entender por el contexto. Y eso va a pasar muchas veces. A veces usted no se, no se sabe esa palabra, pero entiende lo que quiere decir. ¿Sí? And that's a good help. So, let's have two minutes to read it once again and understand it. Two minutes. Okay, guys, uh, when you finish with the reading, I will go through the attendance list, okay? Mientras terminan con el reading. Um, Angela Estefania Marroquín Martínez. We talk our inventory. Yes, we don't have... Cristian Josué López Pérez. Present. Estela Mabel Loreana del CID. Present, teacher. Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Present teacher. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortés. Present. Jessica Present. del Carmen Vázquez Vázquez. Present. Jonathan Alexi González Torres. Present teacher. I'm here. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Thank you. Present teacher. Ok. Carla Elizabeth Escobar Esquivel. Present. Kenny Lizette Cuellar de Barrientos. We did, we did, I think we need to stop Kevin Alexander Aguila, Aguilar Bonilla. Linda Magali García Montoya. Lizette del Carmen Hernández Miss Smith. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Thank you. Thank you, Linda. Marcos Amilcar Mancía Gutiérrez. 
Present teacher. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Present teacher. Marielo Janet Cornejo Erazo. Present teacher. Marta Lidia Godínez. Sabrina Lizeth García Orellana. Present. Sur Mayerita Oliva Córdoba. Present. José Nelson Ruiz Moreno. Judy Alexandra Flores Parada. Yes. We don't have SMEs. Thank you. Iliana Carolina Calderón Cisneros. For chocolate caramel. Because right now okay, guys. So, um, what do you understand about stock? Do you know whenever uh, something is in a stock in the inventory? What does it mean, stock? What did you understand by a stock? Como cantidades en existencia. Mm -hmm. uh, but I think it's when you renew the inventory, when you uh, don't have products and take another products about in the bodega. I don't know how this, I don't remember. And put put in the in the vitrina. I don't know. Don't worry. Um, in that case, okay. warehouse warehouse will be the 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 bodega, right? Warehouse warehouse, I, I or it can be a groceries. No, that would be a warehouse, right? Uh, Y la otra que me preguntó, sorry. Store. Uh, yo dije vitrina because I don't remember the word. Ah, <laughs> okay, don't worry. I believe vitrina is like a shop window. Shop window. Sí, shop window. Shop window. The, the, la vitrina, right? Shop window. Sorry, give me a second. Sorry, Amabel. Okay, yes, Mabel. Mabel is right. Guys, a stock means whenever you don't have product anymore. A product is a stock. Okay? It, I mean, you don't have product. That's a stock. Whenever a product is in a stock in the inventory, you don't have that product anymore. Uh, now, what do you think, guys, about inventory turnover? What do you think is inventory turnover? It's like a rotación del producto. Okay. It's close, close. Another idea? What, what did you understand by that, guys? Cuando lo leyeron, ¿qué entendieron de inventory turnover? Como la salida del producto del inventario. No. Ajá. Uh -huh. Very close like that. Yes. Um, Jonathan and uh, Fatima, you were so close. You were so close. It's basically uh, what you said. Whenever it is uh, the rate that the inventory is stock is sold, is used or replaced, right? So it is calculated uh, actually by dividing the cost of the goods or the products, right? By the average. So it is like what you said in Spanish, Jonathan, es como la rotación del inventario, right? 
Eh, y básicamente eso está localizado en lo que se vende, lo que se utiliza y lo que se reemplaza en el stock del inventario. Entonces sí tiene mucho que ver todo lo que ustedes me dijeron. So very good, guys. Good job. Ok, let's see. So, now guys. Uh, let's go ahead and work on this. Let me get a second. Work on particular amount of anything. We have some definitions here and we have some words here. We have cost, we have inventory turnover, we have a stock quantity and inventory. Try to put the words or try to match the words with the definitions, okay? Let's do it right now. Well, let's do it together, guys. Guys, I would like you to give me one moment, okay? One moment.
cabeza. Right, guys, did you finish? Can we do it together? I finished. Great, thank you, Fatima. Guys, we will do it together. We'll try to resolve it together, okay? Let's see. What do you think that is in the number one, guys? What is the best definition for the number one? It's a particular cost. amount of anything. Sorry, Jonathan. Cost, I think. Cost. Okay, great. Cost. All right. What about the number two? A complete listing of mer merchandise of stock on hand. Inventory. Inventory. Great. Inventory. 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 What about the next one is um, the price paid to get something? For me, it's cost. cost. In the number cost. three is cost. In the number one cost. is... I don't mm -hmm. remember. Quantity. Quantity, Quantity. one. And quantity. Cost. quantity. So, what will be in the number one? Quantity yes. is in the number one. In the number yes. three is cost. Okay. All right. So here is quantity, right? Yeah. And in the other one is cost, guys. Yes. Okay. What about the number four? Inventory toner. Inventory toner. Inventory turnover, right? Turnover. Turnover. All right. Inventory turnover. What about the number five? Stop. Stop. Stock. Okay, it says quantity, a particular amount of anything. Okay, inventory, a complete listing of merchandise of a, or a stock in, on hand. Cost, the price paid to get something. Inventory turnover, the number of times a company sells its inventory a year. Very good. Stock to get more product in the inventory. To get more product in the inventory. Very good. Good job, guys. So I would like to ask you guys, 
Do you remember? Because I'm lost. I don't know. Did I pass the list, the second list? Sorry, I don't remember. Yeah, that's true. Yes, right? Okay. Great. Okay, guys. So now we have a reading practice, okay? We have a reading practice. And the reading practice that we have is this. Uh, read. We will have to read the description of the chocolate products below and complete the chart with products and specification. We have a spicy bean, a spice, sorry, a spicy bean and toffee. We have turtle, uh, turtle candies, chocolate covered caramels. We have chocolate dipped nuggets. All right, and here you have the prices. Basically, those are the description of this kind of products, okay? Then what, what we need to do, guys, is to complete the chart with the product specifications. Tenemos que completar este cuadrito con las especificaciones, okay? For example, name, a spicy peanut toffee, okay? What is the code for this? What is the code? What is the size? What is the ingredients? What is the weight? What is the price per unit, etc. Okay? So once you read the description, you will complete the chart with the product specifications. That's a reading practice, guys. Let's try to do it the best that we can, okay? Let me share this on the WhatsApp group. One moment. Okay, I already shared the the what the exercise, sorry, that we will do right now. We will do it in the same groups that we had, okay? I believe that what we will do right now is to go ahead and just make some changes. Marcos Amilcar move with Number six. Number three. Okay, do me a favor and click on join, guys. Click on join, please. Let's see. Yes, click on join, please, guys. Teacher, estaré de oyente un momento. Okay, fine. Click on join, guys, please. Maybe yes. Ahí en el manual. Ahí yes, está el manual. manual. Uh -huh. Gracias. Bueno. Okay, I have to read the, the box. Ok. 
Okay. I will the first. Encontrar la página. Okay. Spicy peanut toffee. For spicy peanut toffee is made with butter toffee. Was the Nuts and science that put Safi is a perfect combination of sweet, salty, spice, and crunch. Through the candy box, size station. Okay, name, coding, size, ingredients, weight, price per unit, box of six units. Solo que veo un montón de eh, ah, eh, para cada uno hay que hacer un, un cuadro, ¿verdad? Yes. Sí, por para, ejemplo, para cada uno. Para cada uno. Por ejemplo, donde dice nombre, habría que poner, por ejemplo. Okay. Empezando desde la mantequilla, dice que está hecho con mantequilla y se lo significa tosto. Ajá, y como hay otra cajeta. Ah, Sofía es caramelo. Es un poco dulce, picante, salado y crujiente. Crujiente. Ah, entonces, el primero solo te envía el, el, el ingrediente y el precio. Uh -huh. Bueno, la otra sería Torture Candies. Price seven fifty seven dollar fifty cent. Wait, we don't have to wait. Ingredient uh, butter toffee. Eh, el segundo, el nombre es el segundo es tu Turtle eh, Candies. Turtle Candies. Uh -huh. Aquí encontramos los ingredientes, ingredientes, rich. Um, unit. O sea que la caja contiene seis unidades. Seis unidades. Uh -huh. But one unit, the price is seven with 15 cents. It's like uh, 
No serían los 750 por la caja. I don't know. I believe it's the whole box for six pieces. Uh, I don't know where you are. Sorry, I don't know where you are. But in the box, I mean, in the chart set, said price per unit box with six units, right? Mm -hmm. So it is the seven dollar, the six thirty. I believe it's this one. But seven dollar with. 50 cents seven is the 50. price for unit. Uh huh. Seven fifteen is the price for unit or for box with six units. The box for six units, I believe. I mean, in the number one, spicy peanut toffee, it doesn't mm -hmm. specify, right? But in the other one, says the six units. So you put it the seven fifty. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, we do it like that because at the end it doesn't specify, but in the other three it says that it's the box for six pieces. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And number two, and then sorts of candies. The code from half Perdona, que half no le pusiste en el price siete cincuenta. Yes, seven fifty. Two two candies for two. Two two candies. Two two. Teacher, en el, en el caso del cuadro número uno, uh -huh. el spicy peanut, can, uh -huh. vea que como código no, no aplica. No, it doesn't have. Mm -hmm. If it doesn't yeah. have code, código. <laughs> If it doesn't have code, you don't put it. Okay. Don't worry. Y site, uh -huh. lo tomaremos como una orden nada más, va sí, entiendo yo, para una orden. Uh, let me see. Person. The size will be the box of six units. No. It doesn't say size, right? Mm -hmm. Box size is starting with six pieces. It doesn't say the price, right? No, it's el, 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 el size. Mm -hmm. No dice. Uh -huh, you're right. So size and code, some of them doesn't, I mean, don't have that. I believe that all of them don't have the size and the price. I mean, the size and the, and the, oh my God, and the code. So don't worry if it doesn't have it, it's fine. Okay. Okay. Entonces, puede ir. En sites, sí, son six pieces, ¿verdad? Six pieces. Cuatro son. 
Vai, ele parece de seis trinta. Vai, agora vamos Hello, hello. 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 <laughs> How are you guys? Fine? Uh, fine. Okay. And the chart, we don't have call and weight of the product. Mm -hmm. We don't have it. Let's see. Um, we don't have uh -huh, code and code and size, I believe, and weight. Just put the ones that you find. The size, uh, we, don't, we have to to product box size starting with six piece and the second product total candles. In the second one. In the second one, yes. Six In the third. Pieces. Ah, okay. And but that will be the amount, no? Amount. Mm -hmm. The amount of pieces on the on the package. I mean the amount of units on the box. Yes. Um, mm -hmm. I believe that we don't have size, weight, and code, I believe. We don't have it. <laughs> what? Don't have, what, right? is, what is another? I believe we don't have code, size, and weight. Size? We have it in uh, some products, I believe so. Like a uh, mm, 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 chocolate covered caramels. Box sizes starting with six piece, pieces. Six it's pieces. It's not correct. Box with six pieces. Oh, yes. Box with mm -hmm. six pieces. Yes. In this one, and another is um, five. And the turtle candy. Uh, um, I got confused actually in the previous group because some of them said price per unit. What do you have in price um, per unit in the number one? No, I believe I, I, I don't know. You don't have. We have price, but we don't have, we don't know. It, it's a price we per per unit or it's a price per box price per unit box with six unit mm -hmm. uh -huh. and this is is just when you have boxes and in another in a If the the prices for unit per unit, we don't put it. 
That's what I'm trying to figure out. One moment, Mabel. I, I got uh, confused now. <laughs> yes, I have her headache. I have her. <laughs> but but I believe, and let me see price. Uh -huh, I believe that the price per unit means the box. So yeah. it is the 750, 630, 7 and 7. Yes, that's the price. Yes. This mm -hmm. is a price, but we in this in this case put price per unit. Oh yes, box box size. size. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Mabel. Box size, mm -hmm. yes, you're right. Box size six six pieces. So we have size. Mm -hmm. What we don't have is weight and we don't have code. Mm -hmm. In this case, yes, teacher, you were right. And the last and the price of price per unit, we need to. The price of the box. I mean, the 750, the 630, the seven and the seven. That's the price. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you're fine. The only thing is the, the price, maybe. I will be back, guys, because I really need to correct someone here. Just let me get one moment. Let me go with them. Just one moment, guys. Combination. Hello. Sorry Hello. to interrupt you. Hello, Lisette. Lisette, we were talking about the, we don't have some information, right? We don't have weight and we don't have um, code, but size, yes. For example, in the number two, we have six pieces. That's the book yes. size. Mm -hmm. Yes, right? Sí. Ah, okay, okay. Solamente en el uno creo que es para una porción, vea, porque así asumimos Este uh -huh, because it doesn't say how many pieces. Mm -hmm. We're right then. Okay. Finish, Marcos. Six, twelve, can be decided. Continue the right combination. Uh, of honey, almonds, vanilla, and dark chocolate. The price is the seven. Seven dollars. Okay. Um, Hi, Me. Hello. Um, can you stay with me today in the one on one session? Hi, Me. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, guys. Thank you very much for joining back. Sorry, but because of the time, we really need to go and uh, check the responses or the answers that we have for the reading. We will go to the reading, guys. All right, and I will ask, let's see. Julio, Julio, could you please help me to read the spicy peanut toffee? A spicy peanut toffee uh, or a spicy peanut toffee is made with butter toffee. Rusted peanuts and cayenne chili peppers. A spicy peanut toffee is the perfect combination of sweet, tardy, 
spicy and crunch. Thank you very much, Julio. Amilcar, could you please help me to read the title, Candy? Okay. Uh, boxy size start pairing with uh, six five pieces, a rich buttery caramel, fresh fresh roasted chicken, dark or milk chocolate. The price is six thirty. Dollars. Perfect. Good. Uh, Carla, could you please help me with the with this chocolate covered caramels? Chocolate covered caramels. Chocolate pour caramel and chocolate box size and try with six uh, PCAs. I am seventeen dollars. Seven dollars. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry. Uh, Christian, could you please help me to reach chocolate dip nugget? Wait. Chocolate this nugget. What is this? Ah, uh, chocolate this nugget. The code is for me zero zero four. Size is small. The ingredients are honey, almond, vanilla, and dark chocolates. The weight is six ounces, and the price is seven dollars. You have to off the microphone. Sorry, Christian. Thank you. How did you get the pro the weight? Five. Sorry. I don't know for logic. I ah, okay. imagination. Ah, okay, okay. Sorry. <laughs> and also the the code is zero zero four because it's the number four, right? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for improvising. Good. Okay, so let's see, guys. Um, Mabel, what do you have for a spicy peanut toffee? Could you please explain to me the chart, like the name, the code, the side ingredients? Okay, a spicy. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. The name is a spicy peanut toffee, right? Okay, a spicy peanut toffee. Uh, we can, this is the name, a spicy peanut toffee. And we have the ingredients. Uh, they are mm, butter toffee, roast, peanut, no, I don't recall how it's pronounced. Peanuts, peanuts. Peanuts, peanuts. And how do you pronounce cajeni? Cajan, 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 chili, pepper. chili pepper. This one. And we have the price. It's $750. Very good. Great. Let's see. Um, Marta Lidia, are you there? Or Marielos, Janet? Okay, teacher. Okay, thank you. Could you please explain to me the chart for Tattles candies? Okay, next, Tattles candies. Code, code number two. Size box white, six units small. Ingredient, in, ingredient, ingredient, and rich. Bar, 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 caramel, dark or milk chocolate. Uh, we went eight ounce, price per unit, six thirty dollars. Six thirty, very good, thank you. 
What about the chocolate covered caramels? Could you please help me, Jadixa? Okay. The name chocolate covered caramel, code number five, side box with six units is small. Ingredient chocolate per caramel and chocolate. Uh, weight is five ounces and price per unit seven dollars. Okay, great, perfect. Thank you guys, you did an amazing job. Thank you a lot for improvising whenever you didn't have uh, the weight and the code. Okay, thank you, you did an amazing job there. Uh, I just want to say that in case you are, for example, in a real, in, in a real exam, like let's say the TOEFL or the toy, if you don't have this information, you don't fill it out or either you put an A, all right, that you don't have this information, or either you don't you don't fill that form, okay? In case you are in a real exam or in a TOEFL or in a TOEIC, that is very common. Other than that, very good, guys, all right? So guys, I would like to ask you, since today is the last day for you to deliver in the five homework assignments on the platform. I would like to ask you if you have any question or any doubt, any problem um, completing the, the whole uh, homework assignments, guys? Tuvieron algún inconveniente alguno de ustedes con respecto a esto? O todo bien, guys? Todo bien, teacher. Todo bien. Bueno, cualquier cosa me dejan saber. Voy a pasar la lista ahorita. Les voy a, a pasar lo que son las presentaciones en caso ustedes las necesitan. Al grupo, guys. Y cualquier cosa me dejan saber. Por favor, completar estas cinco unidades. Sorry, cinco tareas antes de la medianoche, please. Para que yo pueda mandar mañana las notas de esta semana. Please, guys. Háganlo antes de la medianoche. So, um, voy a pasar la lista. Espero que tengan una excelente noche. See you tomorrow, guys. See you tomorrow. We start a new uh, week tomorrow. An another, um, another week, okay? And uh, let's see. Have a wonderful night, okay? Solamente Jaime se queda conmigo, please. Let me go through the attendance, please. Ángel Estefanía Marroquín Martínez. Cristian Josué López Pérez. Thank you. Present. Estela Mabel Orellana del CID. Present. Uh, Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Present teacher. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortés. Present teacher. Jessica del Carmen Vázquez Vázquez. Present. Jonathan Alexis González Torres. Present teacher. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Present teacher. Good Carla Lisa, good, good night. Take care. Carla Present. Lisa, good night. Present. Thank you. Kenny Lisset Cuellar de Barrientos. Kenny. Kevin Alexandra Aguilar Bonilla. Linda Magali García Montoya. Present teacher. Thank you. Lisset del Carmen Hernández Miss Smith. Present teacher. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Marcos Amir Carmancía Gutiérrez. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Marielo Janet Cornejo Arazo. Marta Lidia Godínez. Present teacher. Thank you. Sabrina Lisset García Orellana. Surma Yerica Oliva Córdoba. Thank you. Present. Good night. Good night. José Nelson Ruiz Moreno. Yuri Alexandra Flores Parada. Present, Miss. Thank you. Ileana Carolina Calderón Cisneros. 
Okay, guys, so since time is over, you can go and you can rest. Okay, you, you, yeah. Y estas, quiero ver, las cuatro secciones hay que llenarlas para las 12 de ahora. Sí, Fátima, las cinco, de hecho. Yo sé que usted ha tenido problemas con la plataforma y lo, de verdad que lo siento mucho por eso. Eh, si tiene preguntas, me avisa. Y yo Pero solo te parecen cuatro. Solo cuatro, no le aparece la quinta de la unidad cinco. No. Yo creo que ella habla de secciones, tiene que entrar a la sección uno para ver las cinco tareas. Ah, entiendo. Entonces le aparecen las cuatro secciones de las semanas, ¿verdad? Ajá. Entre, cada, entre la primera y esa es la, la primera, tiene cinco actividades. Y esas son las que vamos a hacer. Ah, esas cinco son las que tienen que estar es ahora. Sí, exacto. Fer. Ah, okay. Muchas bueno. gracias por gracias. preguntar y gracias, Cristian. Yeah. You're welcome. Bye bye. Bye, Marcos. Bye, bye, guys. Take care. Have a wonderful night. Bye. Bye, teacher. Bye bye. Hello, hello, Jaime. How are you today? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. And Great. You seem to be right tired <laughs> or you're sleepy because of the raining. The what? The oh. <laughs> Oh. Yes, it's raining here as well. It's raining. And whenever it's raining, you would like to go to sleep, right? And oh, to yes. stay in your in your in your bed. But we almost done. Eight more minutes and you are done, Jaime. <laughs> Thank okay, you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much for staying with me. Jaime, I would like to uh, say congratulations because I can see there is a great improvement on you. And I could see that you have been participating more and more and more, and that is helping you a lot, so you are improving. I really like the fact that you understand a lot right now. You are in your level, okay? You're in your level, you're good. And you have been always that kind of participant or that kind of a students that have a lot that has a lot of potential and I always say good things about you in the comments <laughs> uh, because that's true that's true Jaime so I thank okay. you very much for your participation because sometimes I feel alone sometimes I mean there are some courses or there are some classes that it's difficult that people um, participate maybe because of of the mood I don't know, because of the moon. <laughs> no, 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 I'm just kidding. It's not because of the moon. <laughs> no, okay. it may be because of the topic, etc. But you are one of the one of the participants that you always support me in that way, that you always participate. So please continue like that because you are doing great. Um, I really like as well. Um, as I said, the pronunciation, right? The fluency that you're getting, good. The speaking that you're getting as well. I believe all the skills are good on you. If there, if there is one skill that is that you're struggling or you are, you feel that you are like um, struggling or it's difficult for you, let me know so we can we can see how we can help you. I I haven't noticed, I haven't noticed um, your your shirt. I haven't, I haven't noticed your shirt before. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> okay, thank you, teacher. It's, um... But yes, that's what I wanted to, uh, the logo. But that's what I wanted to, to tell you, uh, Jaime, that I want to say congratulations because of this. If there's anything that I can do regarding your learning process, tell me, please, because I feel proud of your learning process and I would like to be part of this. I mean, if there's anything that I can do regarding this, uh, let's do it. If there is any comments, any feedback about the class as well, we always listen to our participants. I always listen to you guys because maybe we don't notice. 
maybe we don't, I mean, we don't have the same perspective as you have. So it's good to know. If there's something that maybe you don't like, something that you believe that can improve the class, now that you are a teacher, you can help me with this. Um, so that's pretty much. I'm so talkative, so let's go, Jaime. Tell me. <laughs> okay. Um, in this in this level, I think I feel good, really. Um, Yes, I tired <laughs> because I, I I wake up early in the morning. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's normal. I I wake up at uh, four thirty. Four thirty. Wow. Yes, every day, and I I come back at uh, three p.m. and I go into training with my daughter. Um, you don't have chance to sleep in the no. afternoon? No. <laughs> wow. Before, before when, when we have to virtual, virtual class, we, I, I have a time with the sleep mm. one, one hour in the afternoon, but um, in this time we, we start the class all days in the presencial, presencial class. And <laughs> I don't know. It's more I difficult. I can rest uh, one moment. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's very uh, complicated, mostly whenever you become a, a parent, right? <laughs> right. Because if you and, were single, I believe that you will have more time, right? To sleep. Yes, and before to start the the class, I go I go with my my father, and and I I start the class. Oh, so you don't have no time at all, right? To sleep or no. to rest a little bit. I'm going to this way. I'm 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 going to the <laughs> same way, Jaime. <laughs> Yes, Whenever uh, you yeah. say, you know what, I didn't have time because I don't have time because I really need to go with my daughter. And I say, wow, I'm going to that way. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you have a daughter? No. I will be, I, I, I will have a, I don't know if it's going to be a daughter or a son, but yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> didn't I mention? I mentioned it. Daughter or son? I don't know. I don't know yet, <laughs> Okay. but soon, I will do it soon. Okay. But I'm not single anymore. <clears throat> okay. So I know the difference that you are telling me. Sometimes you have time to sleep and sometimes not for now. Later on, I won't have time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I say, uh, I feel well in this mother, mother? Mm -hmm. Yes, it's fine model, and of course. I think I going I go away in the on the in learning. The, in, in, okay, in the learning, and I I I difficult when when I try to speak. I need practice more practice. Mm, okay, I got you. But what about on the in the school where you are right now? Can you practice that or is not too much? Mm, I practice just listening because this is because you're a Spanish a Spanish teacher, right? Yes, I, I am oh, a Spanish teacher. But I I have a a partner in, in fear, fifth, second, third. Um, every every grade we have one teacher in Spanish, one teacher in English. Mm, okay, so you are, but you need to practice more, right? You said that you are. I mean, you're good at maybe a listener and writing and all of this, but you need to speak more. Yes, I need to speak more. Wow, in that case, Jaime, what I can recommend to you. 
it's difficult because because of the time that you have i mean you don't have time it's difficult to to give you like those kind of advices but the only way possible now is in your job to find someone that you can speak with in your job that's the only way right now I would like to say, let's go ahead and download an application and you can talk to another people, but with, with what time at the end, you don't have time, right? So my best recommendation will be to find someone, Jaime, in your job that you can speak with. I try to speak with the, every partner. <laughs> mm -hmm. Try to do so because that's, the, that's your opportunity there. And that's the way of doing it because in your house there's nobody, right? You can stay with. I and you don't it. have time. Or yes. I mean, if you have time, if you might be having time, try to speak with someone. If there's someone in your house, if not with a relative, with one of your family, if not, download the application that I told you before, which is people talk. I always make a mistake with that application, but it's people talk. Yes, I believe so. People talk, download it, and you can talk with people in, from United States or maybe from England. I mean, uh, maybe you are not going to go ahead and call them, but at least to send audios, to listen to the audience and to talk to them. That is a good interaction, actually. Okay. I didn't rec I haven't recommend that application to you. Yes, but I yes. can I I don't I remember. Can, yes, I have to recommend yes. it. Oh, okay, okay. But I can use it. <laughs> ah, okay. It is like a social media. It is like a Facebook, let's say. But what you need to do, Jaime, is that you need to send friend request and to start talking. I mean, at, at the end of the day, remember that what you're interested in is, is, is on practicing. That's the only thing. So if you are interested in practicing, let's go ahead and send the friend request to people from the United States or from England, people who knows, people who, who are native, and that will help you a lot. But let's just start talking with them. I mean, don't feel ashamed or don't feel you cannot do it or don't feel like oh my god i don't want to do it because at the end it is regarding your learning so try to do it and try to speak with them maybe what i can tell you is that sometimes it's difficult to keep the interaction with the same person every single day or whenever you want right so maybe you need to have a list of 10 or a five at, at least so you can talk to them send audios receive audios it's good. I try it and it worked for me a lot because okay. that application is exactly for learning, not for doing something else. So I really like it because people over there are there because they want to learn. So that's what I like. So that's the, okay. the other thing that I recommend if you don't have someone to stay with. But that's the only thing that I can recommend because we, are, we don't have an environment in which we can speak English unfortunately and if you want to speak with someone you know that i am there you can send me an audio i can respond i can answer that audio and we can try to do a conversation like that you know that i'm there okay in case you would like to practice with me i am there okay thanks teacher you're welcome i tried it when i yes. i uh, i have a, a time when you have time uh, one, I know. one one moment free <laughs> yes i know it's difficult jaime but i know you will do it you will find a way of doing it and at the end that will be a, a need for you because you want you will you at at the end i mean i mean later on because you're trying to learn and you you are hungry for learning this language you will be able to do it you will find a way so I thank you very much for the time, Jaime. I don't want to go ahead and uh, and tease you or I don't want you to stay more time because you feel tired and you need to sleep. So thank you very much for your time. And if you need any other help, don't hesitate to go ahead and text me on WhatsApp, okay? 
Okay, teacher. Thanks for your time. You're too. welcome. Have a wonderful night. Take care, Jaime. Thank you. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye -bye.